welcome friends we would be discussing about geometrical entity selection methods now we will concentrate on the first method that is window selection method coming to window selection method in this case only those entities that are selected that are enclosed within the rectangle that means there is a selection rectangle and those entities which are completely within the rectangle those entities are selected those entities which are crossed by a rectangle and entities which are outside selection rectangle are not selected that means those entities geometrical entities which are outside the rectangle and those entities which are crossed by the rectangle they are not selected selection rectangle is drawn from bottom left corner to top right corner so it is always from drawn from bottom left corner to top right corner fourth point a line since selection rectangle are solid in nature so there are two types of lines dashed line and solid line in this case you can see solid line area within rectangle is in blue color so for identification purpose to know that the methodology is window selection method so inside area is always in blue color you can observe here so i have drawn point 1 point 2 and then entities circle c1 c2 c3 c4 line l1 l2 l3 l4 l5 so here this point 1 that means this uh, window is drawn always from bottom left corner to top right corner so here circle c1 is completely enclosed within the rectangle circle c2 is also enclosed completely c3 is also enclosed line L l1 is enclosed within the rectangle line l5 is enclosed within rectangle whereas circle c4 is crossed l4 is crossed l2 is crossed l3 is outside the selection area so in this method the rectangle which is drawn here has got solid lines four solid lines it is made of solid lines and the inside area is in blue color you can observe here so those entities which are completely enclosed within the rectangle that is c1 c2 c3 l1 and l5 are selected whereas crossed entities like c4 l4 are not selected and then l2 is also crossed it is also not selected l3 is outside the selection area neither it is crossed nor it is enclosed that is also not selected so that those are the highlights of this particular method now we will go to autocad and see how exactly it works the window selection method so what you have to do is just left click near the point p1 and then try to drag it you will get a rectangle and the rectangle is filled in blue color the lines which are made of rectangle they are solid in nature just move the lines move the cursor so you will reach this position point 2 so now circle c1 c2 c3 are enclosed within the rectangle lines l1 and l5 are enclosed within the rectangle lines l2 and l4 are crossed circle c4 is also crossed now just click here so those entities which are completely within the rectangle are selected those are uh, circle c1 c2 c3 and lines l1 and l5 so we had crossed line l4 line l2 and then circle c4 those are not selected and the line which was outside the window that is l3 that is also not selected thank you very much after this we, we are going to discuss about window crossing method